Because device use for ambulatory treatment should be simple, the BD Bodyguard Infusion Pump intends to offer both clear controls for ambulation and ease of use. Our last video provided guidance on priming sets for infusion. In this video, we'll look at how to set up an infusion in continuous mode. Your medical provider will train you on the specific program that your home infusion requires. It is important that you only use the program prescribed for your specific treatment. Before connecting the line ready for infusion, the IV set first needs to be primed. The prime function must not be performed while the infusion set is connected to a patient. When you first turn on the pump, the default program will display. Immediately press and hold the stop key. Use the up and down keys to cycle through available program options. To change program, press and hold the stop key, then select a program using the up or down keys. If the program is locked, you can only run the program with its current settings. The following program steps apply to a continuous treatment. Press the OK key to continue or press the stop key to enter a concentration. Enter the concentration and confirm with the OK key. Press the stop key to switch to milligram, milliliter units. To switch units to milliliters over hour, enter a value of zero and press the OK key. Enter in rate, in rate over volume mode, or the volume in volume over time mode on the numeric keypad. Confirm the setting by pressing the OK key. Enter volume in rate over volume mode or time in volume over time mode. The volume values entered should not exceed the volume in the container. Review the infusion parameters and confirm. To make changes, press the stop key to go back. Once you've reviewed the infusion parameters, you will be asked to start the infusion via the on-screen display. Refer to medical provider's instructions when attaching the infusion set to the appropriate catheter. To start the infusion, press the OK key. For more information whilst the infusion is running and how to stop an infusion, click below to watch the next video.